Opening Christmas gifts on Christmas Day is a feeling unlike any other for hmm. children. But not every kid gets that chance. So an area church makes it their mission to put gifts into as many kids' hands as they can. News 9's Wyatt Williams joins us with more on how they're giving kids a different outlook on the holidays. No kid should have to go through Christmas without presents this year. That's why the Bible Truth Chapel in Walsall and Operation Christmas Child are doing everything they can to make sure there's presents underneath the tree. Operation Christmas Child and the Bible Truth Chapel are teaming up to give children across the globe the Christmas they deserve. Shoeboxes filled to the brim with Christmas gift marked with boy or girl and the age range the toys are for. And something as small as a shoebox can make all the difference on Christmas morning. We are packing shoeboxes for Operation Christmas Child and these are gift filled shoeboxes that will go out to children in need all over the world. According to a study by Turn to Us, one in five children may not get a Christmas present this year. And those numbers are even worse in single parent families. That is exactly why this event is happening, to give the less fortunate kids an opportunity to look under the tree and see at least something under it. It's generosity. People love to give and what better way to give than to give to a child. The goal is to bring enough to send out 8,000 shoe boxes. And the two organizations are using the moment to not only bring gifts to kids who need them, but also to take a moment to spread love and teach about their faith. This is love in a shoe box, and children need to uh, receive these shoe box gifts. Many of them have never received a gift, but along with that, they get to hear the message that Jesus loves them. Shoe boxes can be built at home or even online, and the details for how to build them can be found on the Samaritan's Purse website. You can drop off donations at the church right here behind me in the donation center up until Monday, November the 20th. In Wausau, Wyatt Williams, News 9, WW. Thanks, Wyatt. Well